Hi! I bet you're tired of all those external audio embedders and D embedders. So are we. That's why we decided to integrate audio routing as a native feature of Live Premiere. Let me show you. So, how does it work exactly? Well, the audio signal from any input received by your Aquilum will be available in the WebRCS audio routing section. From there, you will be able to route every audio channel as you wish, going from physical or dente input to physical or dente output, without any restriction. On the rear panel, you will find the dente connectors below the multiviewer. There is two connectors, the primary and the secondary. You will be able to change the working mode, active backup or switcher, using the Dante controller. The first thing to do is to connect an RG45 cable to your Dante network. It can be connected to a switch or directly to another unit according to your network setup. The second thing is to plug video inputs with embedded audio to the Aquilon. I will connect an HDMI source with embedded audio to channels in stereo. In the WebRCS, on the left side, you will find all your inputs. You can easily filter what you want to see, physical inputs or Dante. As soon as audio is detected, you will see a green light next to the channel number. Then it's easy. Just drag and drop an input to an output. Let me remind you that there is 8 Dante groups, including 8 channels, each for a total of 64 channels at 48 kHz or 32 at 96 kHz. Using the Dante controller from Odinate, you will be able to route your audio channels from the Aquilon to any Dante destination. As you can see, I can route two channels from the Aquilum channels 1 and 2 to a virtual Zoom card on my computer. You will be able to find transmitters at the top and receivers on the left side. One more thing. You can also use the advanced routing mode to mix channels from different inputs to different outputs. Some tools are available to mute, send a 1 kHz wave, or remove the routing. You can also limit the number of channels by output. Make sure that you are using an ADID with audio support.